guys and welcome back to another video and today I'm gonna be showing you how to make a project that picks random text that you insert inserted to. So first things first get and make every single thing you'll use in your text you'll use in your text I'm just gonna make three because this is just for demonstrations if you want every single letter then just make every single letter but four so that I can run them out. so here this just seems awful, doesn't it? Now, we're gonna say the pick random. One, two. From one to how many texts do you have? One to have. I'm gonna just set it to two because I, it's just demonstration. So, uh, you're gonna grab a one green flag clicked. You're gonna get a variable. You can delete the my variable. It, it doesn't serve any purpose. You're gonna make a variable that is gonna be called text number. I'm gonna leave it to turn. So grab the set and make it be text number. Grab the pick random from one to your number and Put it in the text number. Now it's gonna pick the text number randomly. It's gonna randomize. Is it gonna be? Is it gonna be one or two? I'm just gonna randomize it every single time you click the green flag. We can now click the text number and make a new variable that is gonna be called. It's gonna be called text display. Display. There we go. Now you are gonna make. Um, you're gonna set this, and then you're gonna put another. In the, how many pick randoms you have? That's how many of these you're gonna train like this. I just want two. So, over here, we're gonna put an equals block. That's gonna be useful. And it's gonna be, oops, pick random. No, 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 but if, Text number is one. I'm gonna put it over here. Then it's gonna set text displayed to whatever you want. This is gonna be that's everything I put, but I forgot something very, very so Q. You're gonna name everything that you put over here just like this. And uh, we are also gonna need a blank. You know, a blank one. And we're gonna name this blank. It's not gonna be nothing. The name isn't gonna be nothing. And now if I'm gonna say like this. But we need to switch the costume to the blank one. And there we go. So now, here comes the hard part. Because we need to make the text. It's, it's not just the randomizer that we have to make. So, 
Now, this is going to be a little bit tricky. And by a little, I mean a lot. So, you're going to go to control and drag create clone of myself in the blank. Blank. You know, the void. <laughs> then, you're going to grab uh, when the green flag clicked. And it's gonna repeat for starters. I'm just gonna leave it 10. So if you want more than 10 letters, just say 90. And even with 90, you can type four letters. <laughs> Seriously. I'm not joking. So uh, this is over here. And then. I'm just gonna grab one, so this is gonna be text, and then, but this is gonna be, you remember, I mean, you know that one block that, I'm gonna show it to you, where is this one, letter one. This is gonna be very important for this video. So I'm gonna put text displayed over here and you're gonna make text letter. And it's gonna be over here. So events. I mean control when I start the clone you are gonna set and uh, when green flag clicked you're gonna set text letter to one now when I start as a clone forever switch costume to letter one of text to letter text letter or text displayed so this is what you're gonna have to make and uh, there we go but there's a very big problem over here so we need to change the text letter by one every time we make a clone but it's not just that as you can see, this is very weird, so now here comes the hard part. You drag the forever out, out of this. And you just switch to no no no, it's it's still forever. Sorry. And we change the X Let's just switch costume. S -s -s Sorry, I just we change the X by I don't know maybe plus maybe size plus no 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 size minus I don't know. Let's just try it out like this. So there's size. Let's try it out now. Nope. It's probably because we need to set the clone X every time. So it's on. I need to show. So you need to show it when you are positioning the X. You need to show the first. Find the thing you want to show. And if you want it to start 
from this right here, my position. And I'm gonna put it over. No, no, no. I'm gonna put it over here. So it's not good. Maybe it just says like the two. No, it's still there is still a problem over here because maybe if we bring the forever back and really I'm experiencing let's try it out so that it just five yeah it's not the problem it's five because you don't want to <clears throat> so it's that let's make another clone thing so let's try like this, it's still the same. Maybe my switch costume was good. So now, as you can see, the clones overlap with each other. But if we change the X, it does not do anything. Maybe if we are going to put it over here, and now it's getting better and better. Because that... Oh, and also I forgot that you need this. The start letter is gonna be Q. You need to have this start letter can be anything. Because the first letter you type over here won't be shown. So just type anything and then the other main letters. So, uh, it's not gonna be size divided by 2, it's just gonna be. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> you know, of course it's not, but it's 50, which is not really good. So we need it to be something like. <clears throat> Where is it? Mm, 10, maybe. Change up to 10? No. Maybe by 30? No, it's because it's too much, I don't know. So you're going to see this problem of, mm, you know, they'll be disappearing. Some will be overlapping and some won't. There's this weird problem where it doesn't work so you're just gonna make a small and then you're just gonna drag it out where you want it to be now you're gonna replace the real thing with this and there we go it's better isn't it so that's basically what you want to know about it because it's all gonna be if you're wanting projects like this then now about the randomizer thing we already started it but we need made the text in it so text displayed to here it's gonna be like this so as you can see it's gonna randomize is it gonna be the first one or the second one now of course you needed to do something you want another clone of P which is gonna be something else and I don't know call it I don't even know what I don't know call something you won't use 100% I know this I won't use that in text if you will I don't know what to tell you but now let's try it out there we go it's already better to you isn't it yeah, it doesn't right yeah there needs to be a problem keep that in mind there just needs to be a problem so yeah the text engine and everything the randomizer is done now if you want size i know like this 
I'm gonna have to change the X. I know it's up to you to experiment with what because this is most of the stuff. So you can experiment with changing the X and how to change, when to change. You can put three and you can have every letter. You can have a can have a symbol. You can name it the symbol. It can. You're free now. Do whatever you want. It just you have the tutorial. You have the basics, and just make it. Get one. So yeah, that's all I gotta say. So we've made the tutorial, and yeah, let's go now. Bye.